This is Sky's first snow. Sky, what are you eating? You can't eat the snow, Sky. Okay, today is January the 3rd and we had our first snow and I was so excited about having a possibility of hunting on the snow until this happened. At this point, I gotta get that big old tree out of the way before I could get out. Welcome back boys and girls and today is January the 5th and we got snow on the ground and I'm so excited about hunting on the snow. But first I had to clear my driveway because we had a big tree that fell on the driveway so I had to clear it out and I worked hard yesterday and I got it done. Okay, this is a lot bigger tree than I expected. But I got my Milwaukee chainsaw and let's see how she goes. Okay, I can't believe it, but I finished it all in three hours. So we had tree from all the way here to all the way there. So that's probably about, I would say about 17 yards. Okay, honestly, I'm not sure if that tree is gonna survive because it's split in half, but that's for me to worry about in another day. Now, I love hunting in the snow because you could see the deer so much better and it's so much easier to drag it out. And this is late internless audio rifle season, so I'll be aiming to feel my freezer and my deer tag. So I still got four more deer to go before the late rifle season is over. If given a chance, I want to take my daily limit, which is two deer. So I'm taking my Browning BAR, this is semi-automatic, and I'll be shooting 165 nozzle in 308. Okay, I'll see you guys up in the tree tomorrow. It's now 707, and I'm already turned. I got here a little late because with all this much snow, my path was kind of covered up. I had to find a new way to get here. But I'm here on time. We'll see. It is 7.42. I see some squirrels moving, but they're not making any noise because of the frozen snow. In most cases, normally when you hear something, it's usually the squirrels that are they're very noisy. But because of their body weight, they're not really breaking into the frozen snow. So on a snowy day like this, when you hear a movement, it's usually a deer. So keep your ears open. It's got one inch spike only one on the right side. I can't shoot.
is 809 and the first noise that I heard today was a medium sized spike drop one end of the bread one side on only about an inch so I had to let it work but that thing looked really tasty damn but it was a whole lot of fun man that was a shame it was a perfect eating size there and at first glance I was only able to look at the left side of his head and it was antlerless and I was so happy but this deal being by itself, I decided to have a closer look at his head. Wasn't you know it, it had about two inch spike on the right side. That spike just saved his ass. But I gotta tell you, if I run into him again without his spike, he's coming home with me. See ya.